and in years to come what's going to happen to it this planet has only so much to offer and and human kind is not being very kind to it it's getting really been abusing it so if not for anything for years to come we need to look at space for some other space where one can i think to me that it's like a plan b a planet b kind of thing i think a part of the problem which i see from a layman perspective in space technology is the lack of simplicity as well we talk about the theory of relativity the relatability also needs to increase so you need to break it down yeah. you need to bring it at a school level today if a kid is curious about space what does she need to do what does she need to understand today our entire quality of education on science per se has been i have not seen a lot of dramatic changes in the way we are actually teaching our kids then you find people who sponsor the explorers yeah you talk about the polar expeditions yeah the nobles or monarchs or the business people who sponsored those exploration or even i mean people who sponsored vasco da gama so you find what is their motive that's commerce so from curiosity then the here is commerce yeah both beautifully combined yeah so you go explore that land find if it has abundance like you say then i'll see how to turn it into trade and commerce but if you have to realize that the us now actually has a space force they have an entire battalion for their space assets mm. right uh probably you know you have been in with the government what would you like is it time for india to have its own like space force as well? energy with the 25 <laughs> years so every country in the world we talking about space war every country in the world collaborates so they they put their best people on board they put all their financial prowess to build a space mission that effectively goes to another galaxy and fixes a problem we collaborate with an alien race we figure out how to communicate with them we bring back another particle that effectively destroys this one and the world is a happy place again <laughs> one of the things that he said uh which i remember pretty distinct distinctly was what we consider as very rare things on earth are in extreme abundance in space it's just about that discovery this is going to be the next big thing right it's it's going to be i mean if there is a commercial implication that can be attached and the commercial implication could be because of the point that i made earlier or it could be because of rare earths and the access to minerals and other things then money will follow automatically right and then and then after that it's just a question of where the intellectual hospital is available normally we say can it law criminal yeah. law and all those stuff so you ask me a question why not space law <laughs> really wow right so any week tomorrow companies organizations countries are going to fight space yeah. in the space yeah. right and therefore can i make a difference there <laughs>